Well, JML is a skilled nursing facility, and within our building we have a subacute unit and we have a long-term care as well. It has grown under Cape Cod Healthcare, and we are able to serve many different aspects of the elderly community, from subacute short-term care where they go back home and they may end up in our adult day health program, or they may end up staying with us extended care, or they may end up living with us. It, it goes way back. My mother uh, was a nurse. She uh, actually spent her summers on Nantucket, uh, traveling around in a horse and buggy with the local doctor. And all of her uh, later life, she uh, worked very hard to take care of elderly people. So that's where the inspiration came from. The mission was to ensure that the quality of care to the residents and the patients here was the best it could be. My husband's mother had Huntington's disease. Huntington's disease is hereditary. He got it at age 50. So he's been going for five years. He goes usually three to four days a week and they have wonderful programs. It's very easy to get very in, in, engulfed when you're a caregiver into only caring for that for your spouse or your loved one and not, uh, not caring for yourself. I think that I was really fortunate because my parents uh, both passed away at JML and it was kind of a beautiful thing which was nice since if he was in the hospital alone and she were somewhere else it wouldn't have worked out. So then we were able to go and say goodbye together and it was a very touching moment. I slipped and came down on my back and I couldn't move my legs or my arms. Uh, once I arrived at uh, JML the, uh, it was incredible. They had, they got me they got me doing exercises that would help me walk and, and get on my feet. I never thought about having to be hospitalized or needing extended care in any shape or form. But it does happen and everyone has to be prepared for it. But it also has to be paid for and, be, and people have to understand that it's part of the community here. You know, places like JML don't just happen by accident, and everybody has to uh, do what they can to uh, make it available by giving what they can.